<clears throat> Welcome, everyone, to Elden Ring Shadow of the Erd Tree. We are actually going to be uh, going into Shadow of the Erd Tree more or less blind. I know about some of the boss appearances, I know about some of the weapons. I went and snagged a couple of early game weapons I don't have to kill any bosses for. But, um, I, I haven't really been doing anything particularly major since, um, what I was doing in this side dungeon was I was going to try and collect something, but I've kind of been struggling to get it. So, uh, I figure I'll just do it later. Um, but I wanted to, I'm probably just going to ignore the mountaintops of the giants, uh, thing right now. Because what I want to do is go to the Shadowlands and work around here a little bit. Uh, I, I discovered this zone. The main gate cross, which apparently leads to this giant frickin' fortress. I discovered Castle Ensis. Um, I also went into the Ruin Forge lava intake just enough to pick up the Smith Script Dagger. I went over to Castle Ensis to grab Milady. Uh, I also went here to pick up the Fire Spark perfume bottle, just because I wanted to screw around with some of the game's weapons. So, it's not totally like, you know, hey, I walked in and here's the entrance. But it's also not totally, uh, like, I haven't really done much of anything in it yet. I guess I'm going to try and come over to the main gate cross and see if I can't progress this area. Because I have a friend who's been doing some of the Shadow of the Erd Tree stuff. And he seemed pretty keen on me going through this zone. Um. Where's my rotten wing sword insignia? Here it is. I could do the godskin swaddling cloth as well. Successive attacks restore HP. Whoa, what? Signed out of PSN. What? That's funny. Uh, I guess we're having some server issues. Or maybe switching over to the Shadowlands causes some server issues. Uh, it could be that they're on entirely separate servers. Uh, I don't know from the main game. I've only picked up the initial... Uh, the initial... thing. Like, the initial, you know, a few Scadu tree fragments. I've seen a lot of the complaints online about the game's difficulty in the DLC and the way the DLC is kind of rigged and set up. And A lot of people's complaints I could definitely really feel. Uh, I think Fextra had a pretty good, I like, thought process on it. Hello, Glory. You all right? You just woke up. Ow. Man, Rotten Wing Sword Insignia is really good with this uh, Smith Script Dagger. Okay, so Giant Scorpion comes out of ceiling. That was an interesting little encounter. They're, they're actually pretty terrifying. Yeah, that was actually really cool enemy design right there. I'm not going to lie. Oh, hi. There's a whole swarm of babies. Nope, nope. Gotta be careful. Nope, nope. Get 
my stamina back. There we go. Oh, those things look so fucking creepy the way they scuttle. Incredibly creepy. Revered Spirit Ash Blessing. Revered Spirit Ash can be found across the Realm of Shadow. Consume this at Grace Sites in order to bolster Revered Spirit Ash Blessings. This bolsters both Summon Spirits and Spectral Steeds' abilities to deal and negate damage, but has no influence outside of the Realm of Shadow. So that's where I finally got my first Revered Spirit Ash. Alright. I am gonna... I'm gonna try and use the Godskin Swaddling Cloth as a means of regaining some of my health, because the Smith's Grip Dagger is a rapid attack tool. Shadow Realm Rune 1. Mm. Yeah, there's no hidden path here. This guy is a liar. So I'm gonna disparage that message so that people don't get taken in by lies. I do like how this game actually lets you disparage messages, though. It's a lot of these fucking baby Scorpider things. It looks like a scorpion got violated by a tarantula. Oh, that's horrifying. I gotta admit, like, again, really good game design on the developer's part here. Because that enemy is disturbing as all hell. Do you want me to head back to the grace that's at the entrance to this area? Yeah, go ahead. already been down here. I don't know why I came back down here. Having a bit of a derp moment. Don't mind me, folks. I derp sometimes. Everybody does, I think. I'm trying to keep an eye on the damn ceiling because... Yeah! Oh, okay. <laughs> that one almost got me. Oh, Hello. Let's, let's not, let's not, let's not get tore up by the Scorpio creature. By the Scorpantula. Oh my word. Yeah, they keep you looking up so that you actually look, don't notice the side. Because <laughs> they're all falling from the ceiling when you first get in here now. Oh my god, this game is so beautiful, even when it's just like. Okay, Bellarat, Tower Settlement. Oh, hi. Hmm. I look forward to this talisman. Go ahead and activate the revered ash blessing so that my revered ashes are empowered. Oh! Apparently I have enough ash to do that twice. There we go. Yes. Neutralizing boluses. Is this door... Yep, that door is locked like I thought it was. Does not open from that side.
like, again, pretty much the only thing I did off camera with the DLC guys itself was, hey, let's go grab this uh, for a few weapons so that I don't have to wait to use the weapons that I really wanted to mess with. Um, as far as what I overall did off screen, I did a lot of uh, rune farming in the main game at Moog's Palace. I basically pushed myself up to level 194. Um, I was also gathering cookbooks and other things that I wanted to pick up in order to be able to get things going and, and have more stuff available. There's a lot of places where people are just kind of really trying to put fake, hey, there's a false wall here messages. I definitely see more trolling here than I normally see. Yeah, they're doing it a little bit more here than, they, than I'm used to seeing. Yeah. You're kidding me. I didn't even know that was a thing. Whoa! Ow! Okay. Uh, these guys are hurling energy discs at me. That's what I love about this weapon. You can just kind of... Like, repeatedly throw these weapons and backstep throw, backstep throw, and you're almost always just out of the enemy's reach. Make some fun. Fire Grease. Interesting. A new form of uh, Flame Grease. Oh, wow. All right, game. When I've got, like, three quarters of my health and I have, like, 60 vigor, I have 55 vigor right now, those guys should not be able to two-piece me. Those are just common shadow enemies. Like, I'm wearing Crucible Knight armor here, okay? Hitting me twice and ripping away basically all of my HP should not be a thing. What? Oh. 
Hello, Rosita. How you doing? Silver horn tender. Well, I did read that right. Kind of obnoxious. Well, they're not even lightning glass. Oh, I'm doing pretty good. Today hasn't been bad so far. Positive that was gonna nail me. Got here. Yeah, they actually do. They hit pretty hard, so I would expect them to have some kind of leniency. Bloodhound Step works really good with this weapon for just keeping you out of danger. So far, my stream's not going too bad. Yeah, these guys with those big cleavers are annoying because they just, they deal way too much damage. Like, they seem to fluctuate from doing average damage to high, there goes half your life. Uh, I'm not going to be opposed to getting warned about potential problem enemies. Yeah, like, that guy hit me and he took half my health. And yeah, I get that that was a heavy swing, but he kind of also borderline auto-tracked with that. Yeah, my stream's not going too bad so far. I can't really complain. He has a to suffer. Glory. Glory, you are going to suffer someday for that. Silver horn tender. What the hell are those? Temporarily boosts item discovery. Oh, it's basically the uh, the silver pickled foul foots. Yeah, I play uh, I play some games like real time strategy, hack and slash. I have played other Souls likes, but I haven't streamed them yet. Uh, I'm a little picky about my shooters. I don't play Counter Strike. I don't play Call of Duty. Call of Duty is just kind of dead to me at this point. That, that series has gone so far downhill from what it was supposed to be that it's not even funny. At least... At least that's how I feel about it. Like, I don't, I don't trash anybody who plays it. I just feel like the series itself is, is basically a dead brand. It really has. Like, that franchise has just killed itself in a lot of ways. And I feel bad, because that used to be a really, really good, really meaningful franchise. And now it's 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 a little bit like Counter-Strike in that it's it's, you know, esports and how many how many versus multiplayer matches can we get people to, to keep coming back and paying for. But in terms of games that I like, I played a lot of Rise of the Ronin lately. For the most part, I like that game, particularly in gameplay. Not a big fan of a lot of the story choices. Just because the game kind of makes you want to choose between two factions. But if you actually stop and look at half the crap that goes on with that game... Um, a lot of it is just everybody is kind of in, in really bad situations and everybody's kind of being screwed in different ways but nobody's really thinking with a with a clear head so 
you know, it's like, what what would be the smartest thing to do? Burn the entire established order down or try to get it to change? You know, fix it from the inside and clean it out? And with, particularly the way the, the, the anti-Shogunate faction of that game works, their idea is basically just burn it all down and kill anybody who gets in our way. And I'm like, kid, can we... Can we not do that? Because uh, that that seems excessive. And oftentimes it is. Because they really don't care about a lot of the civilians that get caught in the crossfire. Uh, yeah, I stream pretty much every day. Uh, I try to find ways to stream every single day if I can. You'll probably find me here around like 2... Two to three o'clock. Oh, jeez. Okay, I, I cannot backstab this guy. Oh, my God. All right. He's trying to kick my shield. And I'm not letting him. Oh, Jesus. That was a very powerful dual sword enemy, jeez. And I saw one of those shadow dudes just kind of leaping up and down over there. Yeah, currently what I'm what I'm streaming right now is uh, the Shadow of the Earth Tree DLC. I okay, was that a trap or no? Somebody's casting at me. I I thought that might have been a light trap there. Anyway. Uh, and I'm also streaming Unicorn Overlord when I'm not streaming this. Um, Unicorn Overlord, so far, it's, it's not a bad game. Uh, I definitely have some complaints with Unicorn Overlord's writing, but uh, the game itself is actually very fun. You'll, you'll probably see me stream a lot of different types of titles. At some point, I want to stream V Rising. Um, oh, jeez. That was my fault. I really should be looking around corners. Checking my, uh, checking my corners a little bit better might have, uh, saved me some injury there. I will say this, some of the mid-tier enemies in this area feel like their HP is very bloated. Like, the guys that have the, uh, the simple... The simple, uh, cleavers, those guys definitely feel like they have more HP than they need. Either that or this weapon just does not hit that hard at all, and I don't think it does. If I want what? I'm sorry, Glory? Oh, okay. So far, I'm just kind of exploring around and seeing what's here. Oh, wow. This game is still an asshole. Ow, okay. I got clipped by the edge of the tip of the cleaver, really? Nope. That was auto-tracking! Like, when I disappeared, he auto-tracked, really? Damn. What a dick. Okay, that might be... Yeah, okay. I could have seen that ambush coming if I had done this. Uh, yeah, I can throw through this. Just not very well.
Yes, I am abusing the environment here. Feeling so proud of that very simple and stupid thing, which is just basically environmental abuse. I am a simple thing. Spinning stones, string. Ow! Where the hell did you come from? No, really, where did he come from? Like, I looked where he could have been. That was weird. I appreciate the uh, the the thought, but no, please, Rosita. I am not interested. I I actually have somebody in mind for that already. Thank you. Storeroom key. I wonder if that's not that locked door that I passed a while back. Seemed like you were interested until you did not actually get what you wanted out of that. Thank you, you jerk. <sighs> I was wondering if he was going to solicitate or not. They all ask that question. Inevitably. Yup. The instant he found out he wasn't going to get any, uh, any money out of sticking around, he bolted. I would rather they do that than what the first one we had to deal with did, which was like, Hi, I'm going to throw a fit and insult the living fuck out of you just because I can, because you turn my offer down, and I'm like, no, I can't. No. Oh, that was the storeroom. And it opens up a balcony up here. Doesn't appear to lead anywhere. Glory, are there any items in the storeroom that I'm missing? Oh, really? You didn't go back and enter this room? Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't think I can. Oh, there's a person in here. Oh, my God, his face. Do I look like somebody from Mesmere's, dude? These old bones fascinate thee yet. Our lands were by thy kind set aflame. Our tower by thy kind veiled in shadow. Thou camest, robbing us of all, spoiling all. Have ye not basked in these deeds long enough? Listen, progeny of the wanton's trumpet. Thy sins thou shalt have thy recompense. The sacred beast shall unleash its ire. Till then, with this old hag, do what thou wilt. For, for what reason dost thou falter, villain, in it? Thy sordid work. Else tuck away thy tail. Loath issue of the rotten's trumpet. Be gone. These lands were ours. Be gone. These lands were ours since times of old. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, so it led me to an NPC. And 
And I've already been to this area, so... Sure, if it's close to me. The small private altar? Fire Knight Queeline. Kind of annoying, but so far it's not super bad. He's got like bullshit here. Health look. That boulder went right through his face, really. That boulder went through that guy's face. I saw that. Jumping does not give you iframes, game. I know it from experience that it doesn't. a magic pixel. If anybody who watches this later wonders why I immediately swapped to the light greatsword I was carrying, NPCs dodge the living fuck out of the Smith script dagger to ridiculous extents. Like, and I mean ridiculous. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, I, I found him. These guys have like no poise. Okay, let's let's equip some blood grease. that I noticed they didn't really have in uh, the main game. I have more range than this guy does, and I'm using a light great sword. He has, like, no poise, I've noticed. Christ, he hits like a freight train. Ow. Uh, 
Okay, what the fuck just happened there, game? I... I dodged, and instead of dodging, it looked like I got caught on something, but no animation actually occurred, and you just let him beat me to shit. What was that? Like, literally, what the hell was that? This guy is just trying to abuse the shit out of his food. I really dislike the amount of hyper armor frames that a lot of enemies in this game seem to get. And the worst part is, is that many of them just get them from what feels like out of nowhere. Horned Warrior Helm, okay. Alright, where's my Dragon Crest Great Shield? And then I'll have to swap to... I think it's guard counters. Yep, enhances guard counters. This guy seems to have a lot of bleed resist too, for whatever reason. That's an interesting incantation. What's the matter? Out of out of fucking crimson tears? Oh Jesus! Gotcha! Thou shalt not evade the flame of Crusade insignia. Let's find it here so I can find out what it does. There it is. Raises attack power after defeating an enemy. Oh my god, that's a really good talisman. Yeah, like, that's terrible for fighting bosses, but that's amazing for clearing entire areas. Jeez, that's a really good talisman. Holy crap. That, that might actually make using the Smith Swift Dagger a little bit easier, as a matter of fact. Hello, Pebbles. My cat has come to say hello, everybody. Yes, Pebbles, I see you. Shriek of Sorrow, Ash of War. Hmm. Oh, is that that... Is that that like, wailing, agonized shriek you use? Okay.
That's pretty substantial. All right, it looks like I can't go anywhere through this courtyard currently. Yeah, no, I can't even jump up there. Here's where I can go up. Arrows. Cool. I mean, it's it's incredibly useful, I can already tell. Saw knives flying out. Swings weapon. Exposes self like moron. Uh, one thing I've noticed about NPCs, they'll dodge the hell out of thrown weapons, but they do not handle dragon breath very well. Yep, there he is. Oh, yep, I knew I was gonna do that. Ow. I do like how much damage these seem to do for stagger when they hit an enemy in the head. perfectly around that edge. Take a dive off that waterfall, Jimbo. Oh, that is definitely a notable damage boost. Like, I can feel that damage boost. Which is good, because one problem the Smith Script Daggers have is they really don't hit very hard. But, uh, there's a couple of ways to fix that. You've shown me one. Another is Rotten Wing Sword Insignia. The Well Depths Key. I'm not sure if I know where that goes. Uh, the only reason I thought the storeroom key might be where it was is because the storeroom key... Oh, jeez. Camera's freaking out. The storeroom key... Hi. Booty shake. Yeah. For anybody wondering, I will be showing off where these weapons are, uh, where I picked them up from. So don't don't worry about whether or not, you know, like, is, is he just, like, going to play this and not show us where those are? No. I am going to show you where I got these. Shit. Hello. Yeah, I gotta get around this death bird first. Oh god! That was close. There 
There we go. Those, uh, those birds are not to be taken lightly. They, uh, they take a lot of damage and they can very easily deal a lot of damage. Alright. You know what? I'm gonna leave him there. I'll deal with him when I'm ready. And by when I'm ready, I mean whenever I damn well feel like it. Um. Did you mention a Scadu fragment? Looking for him. There he goes. Yeah, he had a revered spirit ash. Awesome. Oh, hi. Um, let's pull my light greatsword back out. That seems to work better on these guys. Yeah, all these guys seem to hit like fucking freight trains. Okay, that was the worst timed roll I've ever done. Oh, you have the damn... You seriously have that bullshit shoulder bash that the uh, bellberry hunter has? Fuck you. Oh god, like... Yeah, the Banish Knights in Farum Osla were not any better. Good fucking god, this guy is beating my ass. Oh, hi. Oh, dear lord. Okay. Okay, this is bad. This is bad. Yep. Alright, alright. Excuse me. Nice try, asshole! Oh, my cat is sneezing underneath my chair. Excuse me while I run into what I hope is a relatively safer area to do it. Oh god! Oh god! Ow! Ow, 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 ow! Stun locked! That's really great, game! You stun locked me for upwards of five seconds so that I can follow me all the way in here and cave my head in. I can see why! Yeah, like I said, I can see why. Like, I hadn't even gotten up there and I got sandwiched and there's apparently another trap up there. I love this sword. I like how the light great sword actually has style to it. Um, one of my enduring complaints about great swords in this series is that it's basically, hi, I'm just gonna slam this giant fucking thing in your face, and that's it. <sighs> Jesus, dude. Why are you doing that to yourself? Okay. I was gonna say that just sounds like a lot of hard work for little to no payoff. Great, three levels for like how many hours of work? Uh, it's not awful.
So you're just making a bunch of unfinished potions and drinking them? Okay, so yeah, no, I have I have like five problems with these guys right now. First of all, that that caster cannot see me, and he was still casting uh, those those uh, holy traps underneath me. Secondly, this guy is hitting barricade shield repeatedly. His giant swords are not deflecting at all. Uh, I have to eat the whole fucking combo in order to be able to have a window to attack it. And this guy drains a metric fuck ton of stamina if you use barricade shield like I do. And lastly, Mr. I'm gonna throw holy bolts at you from up top. Um, kiss my ass, dude. Like, seriously, that. Oh, jeez. That was my fault. Ooh, right up his ass. That was a good shot. But. Yeah, no, like, th th throwing enemies like that at you that don't bounce their weapons off of a heavy deflection type and can unleash combos that long. It's kind of bullshitty, I'm not gonna lie. That's that's pretty cheap. That doesn't feel very legitimate at all. Like, I just magically reinforced my shield to A, drastically in increase its stability and B, uh, allow me to resist attacks like that, and your response is, okay, well, you can resist it. Well, let's see how well you resist all of this combo. Okay, guy? Oh, you don't have a... You, you've got 40 fucking endurance, and you still don't have enough stamina for that? Too bad. Just too bad. Really? Like, what? within what reason is that? You, you shouldn't create a host of mechanics that you're only going to follow about half the time. Yeah, I gotta find my way over there again. Goodbye. But yeah, one of my enduring complaints about great swords in this series is that a lot of the time you pick it up and your character is just like, I'm gonna swing this heavy weapon and it's gonna do a bunch of damage. And it does. And and, and it does. The problem that I have with that is that there's no sense of style to it at all besides big weapon hit hard. <laughs> there's actually a sense of style, I feel now, to these weapons. With the light great swords. What glory? What, you want me to go down there? I haven't even made it to the ladder yet. Okay.
Okay. Well, I did get the revered spirit ash. If there's nothing else important over there, then I, yeah, I guess. Hi! Yeah, I totally love those little bastards. Those little baby tarantula scorpion monstrosities. That don't make me want to reach for a flamethrower at all. Oh. Hi. I was supposed to go through a doorway. What can I say, man? Uh, I'm an exterminator. Well, they're certainly not resistant to lightning damage. Yeah, well, maybe they shouldn't try to kill me for wandering around. <laughs> then I wouldn't kill their babies and I wouldn't have to kill them. Fucking man fly thing. This is not a Jeff Goldblum flick. How much longer must I suffer? Hell of a long time. Ooh! That was a badass, like, backstab. He just crammed it into his spine and smashed him into the floor. Oh. Yeah, it is, too. Uh, they, we use those predominantly on the vulgar militia, if I'm remembering correctly. Yep, got it, and I got the dried bouquet. Not sure what the hell I need that for. Hi. fizzled on the ground. <laughs> That's aggravating. You know, I've got projectile attacks too, asshole. You wanna know the difference? Mine don't suck. <laughs> That's basically what that looks like. I mean, it looks like a giant river of urine. Ugh. And it's so gross. It's so grody. Oh, well, I fucked that up, didn't I? Oh, fuck you too. I do, although there are some days when I can't remember why.
Lightning! <sighs> Gotta love it. Yeah, if you want a little bit of sorrow, it's about 3,500 super restores from the less I was 72. It's gonna be almost 8,000 super ranging potions from 72 to 81. Ah! 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 Fuck off! Oh, nice game, nice. It's completely fuck up my lightning bolt tracking. God damn it. Only worse. Actually, actually, the head crabs are worse. Because <laughs> the head crab would not have dislodged. Oh god, those things are horrifying. Say what, say what you will about Half Life Two. That game knew horror. Oh god, like two of the big double cleaver guys that I dealt with? Or two of the- Oh, okay. Okay, those are far less terrifying. That surprises me not at all. That sounds exactly like how the AI in this game operates. Fly mold, ew. Oh god, you know, Elder Souls games take you to the grossest places sometimes. You know, Blight Town, uh, Blight Town, the depths, the oh, uh, what the hell do they uh, they call that festering shithole in Demon Souls? An Orlando. Fuck. No, not An Orlando. I was gonna say, on Orlando actually was was the best location in Dark Souls One. I was quoting a, you know, the game of Traps Treasure. I think. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, never mind. Now I know what you're talking about. <laughs> First time, and it caught me so off guard. <laughs> it was one of those don't let them know your next move and that actually surprised me I know right okay I killed the phantoms at the top of the ladder yeah you're at the back of the bridge yep I just wanted to kill him again oh, he dropped something else what did he drop a black firefly. Yeah, he's just. That's his regular enemy drops now. I am not going to go anywhere near that other dude. I'm gonna run the fuck away from him, in fact. Oh, we'll find out here in a second. Get dumped, Jimbo. Oh, thank God that great swordsman went the other way. I I did not know how I was going to handle that guy. Dickhead. Come on. How do you feel now, Johnny? Where's that other caster? There you are, you little bitch. I've actually never seen that. Seen what? The caster buffing the other little guy. Yeah, I didn't know they could do that until just now. Oh, another revered spirit ash. Beautiful. That's what I just said. <laughs> Normally they spend all their time trying to blast me with bullshit through walls. Yep. Alright. I will be nice and all work going up this staircase. There's gonna be enemies that will come out of here. Okay. 
This is the same room with the lower level that had all the scorpion babies in it, so I'm not really surprised by that. Yeah, look at that great loot right there. Yeah, I know. A somber one, really? You fucking kidding me? Christ. This guy thinks. Who does this guy think he is? Like, Ryu Hayabusa? Something walk. <laughs> Did you really just. Oh god, I'm dead. <laughs> Did, you... Did you really just. God damn it, Glory! Oh my god! No, it's not! They're both horrible. Oh! Yeah, you kind of did. Uh, what? Yeah. seems to think he's Ryu Hayabusa. And I hate to uh, break it to him, he's nowhere near that awesome. like them to drop that that ring blade they have that that ring blade looks awesome he can drop that can't he pretty sure that's something they can drop Redmain Freya. Wow. Looks inside the tower sculpted keepers and perched within, we beg of thee, rise. rise. What the fuck even are you? Are you an omen? You're covered in horns. That's a creepy Oni mask face. Divine Beast Dancing Lion. Is that Death Blight? Ow. 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 
าHeal himself by attacking me that way? Stone of Garonk very much. Ugh! Oh my, you have a lot of hit points. Summon lightning everywhere! Oh boy! Ah, fuck! Ow! 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 Stop biting me! Yeah, that bite attack he has seems to heal him a little bit. Oh god, okay, he has frostbite. Ow. Oh, let's not get caught in that, thank you. Frey is about to fucking die. Oh, it can throw tornadoes. That's fucking cute. Okay. Is he... Is he under the influence of rot? Yeah, he was. He was rotted. I can Scarlet Rot this boss? And he died right after he killed me! I got his remembrance! It counted! It counted that death! <laughs> what does it remind you of? Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking when I saw him. Oh my god, I cannot believe that. I hit him with with the rot breath, thinking that I, I was just like, no, I'm already fucked. I'm 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 fucked. I'm gonna die. And then no, it hit him and rotted him in one burst. And I barely did just enough damage. Damn, dude. Divine Beast Head. Uh, don't I need to go talk to that crazy old woman with it? Hornset Grandum? What does it, what does it do besides? <laughs> oh my god, I cannot believe that counted.
How many times did you have to fight that boss, Glory? I mean, it first try, not much issue. Okay. Oh, dear. Insist. This is a dragon focus build, so yeah, here in a bit. I cannot believe that counted. That was the stupidest fucking thing ever. Uh, yeah, I would have. Like, I'm grateful that I got the kill with that, don't get me wrong. But at the same time... What I ended up doing there with Redmane Freya the whole time told me that if she's not the answer I need, the answer that I probably need is, uh, is, um, Mimic Tear. I tried to summon Mimic. He did too much damage to me before I could actually pull him out. I spent that whole, the whole rest of that fight after hitting it with Rock Breath just trying to heal up enough to call the Mimic in. But I was out of, I was out of Crimson Flasks. That was a really cool boss. Like, that was a cool boss. The only problem that I will, that I, that I have with that boss is he's, he's flipping around and flying around so damn much and he's casting so many elemental ailments, I don't feel like he's very fair to any real degree, largely because he can't... Like, hitting him with melee is a huge pain. Oh, how you doing, Isostal? A great anxiety welled up within. Well, my day's going all right. Um, but hitting him with melee would be super difficult. Even hitting him with ranged attacks was a pain in the ass. And the level of damage that he deals, being able to even heal himself a little bit is kind of bad. Uh, is Elden Ring my favorite game? No. <laughs> it's a very good game and I do very much enjoy it, but no, Elden Ring is not my favorite game. <laughs> Uh, my favorite game is probably Resident Evil 4, or its remake. My son, I see. And sir. Uh, I think I just got a new miracle. Yeah, I got a new incantation. Here it is. Summons guardian spirit above the caster's head. No, it's called Watchful Spirit. Remembrance of the Dancing Lion. I'm gonna have to take that remembrance and see what it gives me. I'll put my navy hood back on. I'm from the U.S. That is, uh, that is as close to giving you information on where I'm going to be, uh, on where I'm from as, as it gets, buddy. Sorry. Alright, let's, actually, I'm gonna head back to Round Table Hold briefly to see what the, that remembrance will actually give me.
Yeah, I know a couple of people in Texas. I don't live near that area, though. In gray, okay, Enraged Divine Beasts, raise the potency of storms. Ash of War Divine Beast, Frost Stomp, grants affinities and skill. Okay, yeah, usable on all melee armaments. Divine Beast, Frost Stomp. It looks like it's an improved version of Hoarfrost Stomp. If you're about to solicit services to me uh, in terms of how to update or enhance my streams, please don't. I already have somebody lined up for that. Thank you. There's bell bearing, spell blade set. Uh, would I like to, you know, would I like to be able to move up? Yes, but I will do so at my own pace in my own time and with people that I know and trust. I, I'm sorry, but I'm not just gonna. Yeah, that, that surprises me not at all. But like, every one of them so far just seems to be like, yeah! Oh, wait. Can I get you to, to give me this? No. <laughs> Telling him I know a couple of guys in Texas probably was too much. In all honesty. Yeah. Admittedly, that's still something I also shouldn't have handed over. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna go talk to Redmain Freya after I just killed that boss. That was surprisingly good. Like, that was a... Yeah, like, that was a fun fight. It's got a couple of things about it that I think ah, need improvement, but it's not terrible. Fine battle indeed. It heartens me that another warrior stands among us. Among the beckoned. Long ago, I was stricken by scarlet rot in the swamp of Aeonia, immobile, feverish, and in great pain. I was entirely resigned to death. You used to be a member of the and only kindly Mikola was good uh, enough to seek me out. A member of the Red Mains, didn't you? Swollen and festering, exuding a most pungent odor. And yet he drained the poison from it, despite my wretched visage. Now, I consider this wound my compass. Let us both take kindly May we meet again on the battlefield, brave warrior. Do you wonder why the eternally dour fellow keeps his distance? He's one of the tower's horn scent. I can only assume he fights for his own reasons and carries his own burdens. But we needn't concern ourselves with his affairs. He too was charmed by kindly Mikola and guided here. And that makes us allies. We're not gods, you and I. Even if we did manage to dig up the secrets of his past, I doubt our meddling could ever amount to much. Let us both take Maybe meet again. Okay. She used to be part of the Red Main Knights. That's actually pretty cool. Alright, now, uh. You said you were gonna try and guide me to the dragons? Main Gate Cross. Okay. So the castle front. So, uh, 
Theater of the Divine Beast. Okay. Okay. To an elevator. Spirit Ash. That must be the Skadu tree. It looks like golden energy, but it's radiating far less vibrant light. Um, yeah. Okay, there's a, another fortress up here, it looks like. O oh, tower of ours, hidden in shadow, O oh, lofty spiral piercing the heavens, lead him safely unto godhood, greater godhood, and in the divinity grant our salvation. Hmm. I wonder if he's praying about, about Maquella. Or Mikola, as a lot of them call him. Tower of Shadow Message. Message left by Needle Knight Leda addressed to kindred spirits who also pursue Mikola's trail. The Gate of Divinity lies in the tower, sealed by shadow. That is surely where kind Mikola is headed. We are no Empyreans, but we must locate the path that will lead us there. I will follow the crosses east. Hmm. Interesting. There was definitely a revered ash up here. Yeah, I picked one up, I'm pretty sure, inside that boss chamber. No, no, I picked up his head. I picked up his head, that's what I picked up. Maybe I need to go back to the boss chamber and look. I can't get in here, though, because of all the shadow thorns. I must have to do something in the main world. Yes, Pebbles, I see you. I see you. What are you doing? What are you doing? What you doing, hairball? Hmm? What you doing? Hmm? I'm begging for attention, Human. I'm begging for attention, Human. I'm begging. I'm oh, okay. Uh, I don't see any Skadu fragments in the boss chamber, but there was the revered ash that was on the other side of it, so... That definitely matters. It's okay. You could just be misremembering it. It's fine. The extra revered spirit ash is definitely worth it by itself. Yeah, I think so. 
a little bit. I did not get invaded. I'm going to the castle front because I'm going to go try to go back down that trail and see if I can't find that guy again. Okay, those guys just completely ignored my shield there? What the fuck? Ugh! Yeah, I've had other enemies stomp the ground underneath me before and it's never allowed them to ignore my shield. That's something that the, uh, the Crucible Knights did a lot too. Yes. They seem to be using a technique gleam crucible knights. I don't know if they are actually uh, getting skills from crucible knights though. These guys do a shit ton of damage. guy has a shield, you don't. Mesmer soldier shield and their soldier gauntlets. Swift spear. Do I need to follow this road up here, or do I need to follow the area that leads to the actual Ruin Forge lava intake? Okay. What about a square? Oh, that square all the way in the distance? Okay. Oh, Jesus. That just ignored my shield. That was your foot, not your weapon. You, it, even if it was your weapon, that's still not enough to ignore the shield. Jesus. This guy in his damn ninja shit.
I'm trying. He's not really giving me an opportunity. Why do you have five billion poise? Good God, dude. And what name does he supposedly have? Got a lot of my uh, crimson flasks back. Whoa! What are these worms? Their friend? They won't hurt me? Oh, thank God. Oh, I hear somebody. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to snag this Grace up here real quick while he's moaning and groaning. Hey. My arms, my legs, each lies a bloody ruin. Oh, Bail! Vile bail! Oh, terror incarnate! There is life in me yet! I will soon feast upon your heart! Mark my words! You too shall know fear! This guy's got some serious fucking gusto and I like it! The, the exquisite pain. <laughs> Okay. All right. What? What? Okay, I wasn't going to kill him. I did not want him to die. If I recall, I remember lo hearing something about uh about this guy. Huh. you damn grave bird. These guys drop low rank smithing materials like crazy in this DLC. That's definitely something I've noticed. Invaded by Dragon Man. Yeah, it really does. What the fuck is he doing over there? It looks like he's flinging... Oh! He's channeling a magma worm! Secret... Ancient man, secret, ancient man. Oh dear God, okay. Yeah, he definitely, I feel like he should have been hitting me a little bit harder than that. Ow. Asshole. Well, you're dead now. There we go.
You are a true friend and a scholar. That's all I need. Oh, shit! That's all I need. Oh, shit! <laughs> Fucking grave bird comes out of nowhere and tries to peck me to death. <laughs> That's the best comedic timing ever, I swear. Oh, shit. We, we don't talk about that. <laughs> That's basically what it did say. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm okay. I'll be fine. Uh, like, I know how to, I know how to keep an eye on a turret. And then the turret was like, uh, excuse me, motherfucker. What did you say? What did you say? Did, 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 did you open your mouth and just speak bitch to me? <laughs> I was just as soon as I died to that shit I'm like well I did open my fucking mouth didn't I <laughs> uh, I couldn't even be mad I, I, I just could I couldn't. I couldn't even be angry. I was just laughing so hard at that. I was like, well, God damn it, I said it. I did say it. Hello. It's the ancient dragon skeleton men from Karamazala. Hi. I have to jump. Okay. I have a pretty sizable pair of nuts, sir. Uh, excuse me? I've killed every single magma worm in the game so far except Theodorix. You shut your whore mouth. What do you mean this one is built different? I both love and hate what you're doing right now. What? <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, no. You're not breathing fire on me, Jimbo. It's not happening. You missed! I warned you about that flame. Fucking warned your ass. Look what you did. Look what you did. <laughs> Sounds like a load of crap.
in your guts! If you had any! Take down. I'm all right. How you doing today? Oh, I think I found the magma worm you're talking about. of HP. Ow. That's an obnoxiously long lingering hitbox. Oh, and he can hit me through the stairs. I am also fine. Freaking eye socket! No, no, I'm perfectly fine with uh, with how you're handling the situation. I'm, that's fine. abusing it all you are trying to do your job in the most efficient way possible and pretty much everybody who's come in here has done nothing but try to solicit services Ooh, ancient dragon smithing stone I can max out my smith script daggers um all right that magma worm was kind of obnoxious that Well, there wasn't really a better place to hide. I've done that with plenty of them, and it usually is a much riskier strategy. Sometimes being safe and smart is not always the same thing as, you know, being brave and ballsy. He started to get uppity, didn't he? Yep. Yeah, I'm 
I'm sorry, Haley, but you were warned not to solicit services. You did it anyway. You are either a bot or you are not paying attention. I have had a few people come in that just wanted to enjoy a good stream on one or two of my streams, and I was glad of that. But you guys, you guys are like, you guys have been warned about this, so it's... I'm gonna figure out how to make it a Twitch stream rule if I have to. Jump required ahead. Try jumping. Glory, is this the jump you were referring to? Am I going to have to jump over this empty chasm? Glory. What the fuck? Oh my god. Okay, that was terrifying. Oh shit, electric boogaloo. Okay, the Mimic Tear drew the boss's attention. <laughs> I saw that, you little fucking asshole. My phantom is tear like the mimic tear is tearing into pieces. Fucking idiot. Yeah, I saw that coming from a mile away. close. <laughs> the mimic tear is so broken when it has access to those incantations. Dragon Hunter's great katana. Can I even equip that? I should be able to, I would imagine. Here it is. I can use it, yes. It does not have very big requirements, so that's good. Great Katana with spines of gravel stone along its blade, wielded by the ancient Dragon Man of the Dragon's Pit, has an anti-dragon effect. Formerly a Dragon Communion warrior, the ancient Dragon Man was once arbiter of those worthy to devour the Dreaded One. Dragon Wound Slash. Designed to hunt colossal dragons, this skill cloaks the armament with a jagged gravel stone aura before performing a high leaping slash. Charge the attack to also fire off the aura. Very interesting. And there's a door here.
Okay. Yeah, I know. I get to tell John that. Oh, good. I was going to say, because, uh, yeah, you can't work that day, because we're going to be on a plane. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I'm going to have to tell him he needs to talk about, uh, he needs to talk to other people about their availability, because that's not happening. Yeah. That's the day that I am supposed to go off on a plane, and I didn't take it off uh, with vacation time, A, because I didn't have it, and B, because I didn't think I was going to need it. How you doing? How you doing, Charlotte? At least this stream is actually getting noticed. Like, a lot of my other streams weren't. I was probably doing them a little too early in the day. Uh, you wanted me to head right instead of going straight forward. Yeah, you're talking about that little, uh, pond there? Yeah, Charlotte, I'm going to tell you now, if you're here to solicit services for, for my channel, I don't want them, and I don't need them. Please don't. If you're here to enjoy the stream, enjoy the stream. If you are not, please, you know, go find somebody else, because I'm not going to give you a positive answer. I'm sorry. Oh, there's a message up here on top. You would be the fifth person in the chat to ask that, in fact, in the last hour. Bail Oter incarnate, again I stand before ye. There's three drakes in here. Looks like... Oh, only one of them is actually alive. I really wish people who were just here to enjoy themselves would come in, but, uh, no. I keep getting people that try to tell me, Hey, I'm gonna do stuff for you. Just come to Discord and we'll, we'll chat on Discord. You can pay me, and I don't want to, and I shouldn't have to. Like, I'm all for paying somebody for services rendered. I am. But I'm not looking for that. Sorry. Yeah. Hey, Aim. He trapped me behind his wing, and now I can't get to his face. Oh, shit! Yeah, this membrane stops me, because that makes total sense. He's got Scarlet Rod on him from the, uh, from the Mimic here. There goes the Jagged Peak Drake. Mimic Hero P. <laughs> dragon Heart, Dragon Scale Flesh. Nice. 
Dragon scale flesh. That's a new item. I want to head west. Okay. That sounds great to me. I can see the red lightning up in the distance too. That's a really awesome effect in the background. Yeah. Okay, do I need to go east instead? All right, I'm gonna check north real quick. I'm pretty sure north is a dead end, but I'm just gonna eliminate the possibilities here and find out which way you, you need me to go. That's okay. I really need to fix that feed delay. <laughs> South is the way I want to go? Okay. Okay. Excuse me, giant yak. It's a giant what? Oh, it's a lightning ram, okay. Whoa! Oh my god, okay. Jesus, that dragon is enormous. And he's petrified. Grand Altar of Dragon Communion. Why were all my stats yellow there for a second? Feasting upon a dragon's essence on the throbbing heart of the old violence dragon of them all. It would be the purest form of communion, the fullest sating of your hunger and your consummation as a dragon whole. Yes, as it should be. Now, seek the jagged peak. There you will find Bale. The oldest and vilest of all dragons. Landbow warrior. Follow your desire and slay the foul beast devour its throbbing heart. I will grant you the strength required in the name of my lord, Placidusax. You are a servant of the dragon lord, Placidusax? Ancient dragon's blessing. Traitor assailed our master and inflicted a grievous wound, only to make a hasty retreat, becoming a sworn enemy of the group. Since that day, Bale and his bloodline, the Drakes, have served as sacrifices for Dragon Queen, Landbound Warrior. My lord, Placidusax, has shown your kind what must be done. Seek Communion. Sate your boundless appetite. Feel the euphoria of the dragon's essence taking root in the meager fray. I can acquire ghost flame breath, but I haven't killed a ghost flame dragon. Oh, yeah. Actually, that kind of makes sense. Could 
Communion with Bale. I need to actually acquire the heart of Bale in order to get Heat Wave Blast and Flame Lightning. Really? All right, well, I know what my next main objective is going to be here in the, uh, in the Land of Shadows. I am going to be following the Path of Dragon Communion in order to acquire more Draconic Power. I also just acquired... Favor bestowed by Dragon Communion Priestess in the name of the Dragon Lord Placidusax. Consume FP to increase all forms of damage negation, including physical. This also increases damage negation while guarding as an additional effect. Each night, the priestess offers her own sleep to her lord, and in return, receives the power of his favor. Very interesting. What does this look like when I use it? Oh! It does that! Does resting rejuvenate it? No. Okay. Alright! <clears throat> Thank you all very much for watching. That's gonna be the end of the stream for today. I will talk to you all next time when I've been Savage, Hound, Dusk, and We'll be gaining the power of Bale, hopefully, by the end of the next stream. And acquiring more power with the magic of Dragon Communion. Have a nice day. I've been Savage Hound Dusk.